something from you and i need something new oh i got things to prove to you and i know what to do oh you're moving with the light they follow in the night you're always doing right i see you watching too and i know how to move you may not know me but i know your love it's around me under and above you may not know me but i want you close all around me under and above hello everybody welcome back to my channel i hope you liked the little behind the scenes of my mark jacobs cover-up I just needed a minute just to cover up a couple of things to even out my pigmentation and to get my lips nice and moist. So one of my biggest tricks is heating up this tool just to get that lovely extension. You could use your hair dryer just to get it a little bit warm, not too hot, you don't wanna burn yourself. So I just heated up this curler and I'm gonna be using it on my eyes right now. So I want to guide you through the process. You just saw that I curled my lashes with a heated tool and now I'm using some of the L'Oreal Voluminous Base, which is a primer as well. It looks white, looks a little bit scary. You definitely don't want to go out the house looking like this. And I'm showing you exactly what I'm doing. So I'm just guiding my lashes all the way up just to get it nice and long. Right here. And the very next step, I'm going to let this dry for a couple of minutes. And I'm gonna be using my voluminous curved brush. This is probably $7 and it works every single time. Look at how long these lashes are. Look at the difference. Because it's coated with the primer and then you can just drag it all the way out. So they sometimes get stuck together. I would just use my brush, nicely separate them. So you got this fake lashes look, but it's actually your lashes. And I'm doing the same on the other side. Just combing them out neatly. So I want to guide you through the process. You just saw that I curled my lashes with a heated tool and now I'm using some of the L'Oreal Voluminous Base, which is a primer as well. It looks white, looks a little bit scary. You definitely don't want to go out the house looking like this. And I'm showing you exactly what I'm doing. So I'm just guiding my lashes all the way up, just to get it nice and long. Right here. 
around the very next step. I'm going to let this dry for a couple of minutes. And I'm going to be using my voluminous curved brush. This is probably $7 and it works every single time. Look at how long these lashes are. Look at the difference. Because it's coated with the primer and then you can just drag it all the way out. So they sometimes get stuck together. I would just use my brush, nicely separate them. So you got this fake lashes look, but it's actually your lashes. And I'm doing the same on the other side. Just combing them out neatly. Okay, you guys, I just wanna show you one more time. I'm letting this dry. I sometimes go over one more time with my voluminous curly brush just to give it that extra look, extra, extra. So this is my best tip and trick, just to get those lashes that you dream of having without spending the time or money to get lash extensions. I personally don't do well with lash extensions because I always want to wash my face hard and it gets all of those lashes taken out way sooner so I prefer this look so if you like these long lashes I will list all of the items below and you can get your own at home long lash fake lash look <laughs>